Hi everybody, how are you today? In this lesson, we are going to uh, practice reading and writing. Uh, this lesson is in workbook. Please open it, open it on page number 881. The planet is in danger. This is uh, the main topic of unit 11. And uh, one of the dangers that face our planet is the extinction of wild animals. Uh, I'd, I'd like to remind you again many times about the educational value for this month, a good exemplar and good company. Indeed, in the messenger of Allah, Muhammad, you have a good example to follow. You should have good company. Surround yourself with only people who are going to lift you higher. Here, uh, uh, these are some uh, some uh, notes were written by uh, some of your colleagues in another uh, other classes. Uh, here, Ilari has written what he has written a letter or some notes uh, before writing an open letter. Uh, he has written a letter uh, concerning a local a local issue which uh, takes place in his uh, country or in a city. He, say, he writes the letter to the editor of the Natural Kuwait magazine on behalf of my neighbors in Habib al Munawar Street to express our distress from the increasing number of stray cats. So he notes that there are uh, uh, so many cats uh, uh, wandering in the streets. They might harm kids as they are aggressive. They also don't get enough food or, or proper health care. Thus, they usually die or are found injured under uh, the wheels of cars. It started since we moved to Faronia in 2010, uh, so he suggests some solutions. I suggest you send cars to collect those stray cats and mend them and display them for adoption. I would be grateful if you launch a campaign to collect those cats and provide them with proper conditions to live a healthy life. That's a, a very good topic. I'd like to thank you, your friend Ilari uh, and Ayub bin Farid has written uh, another one. This letter is to the World Health Organization. I'm writing this letter on behalf of the students in Al Mubarakia School. I'm writing this letter in order to raise awareness to the problem of global warming. So he talks about what? An international issue, global warming, thereby encouraging people to fight it. The problem has uh, caused severe damage uh, not only to humans, but also to uh, animals. It started in the 19th century when human activities really began to affect the atmosphere and the Tambura eruption in 1815, which caused the year without a summer in Europe. So uh, he talks about what uh, the how uh, global warming started when 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 what when uh, a volcano erupted in, in Europe. In order to prevent this problem, a possible solution could be that people reduce the usage of personal cars and use public transport. So he suggests uh, two solutions for the problem of global warming. Now let's see Mohammed Majdi's uh, notes here. Mohammed Majdi has written uh, some notes. He says, I'm writing this letter to the editor of World Health Organization magazine. I'm writing this letter uh, on behalf of Muhammad, uh, on behalf of my class. I write this letter to discuss the dangerous problem, uh, air pollution, for example. It leads to global warming and uh, desertification. So the main cause of global warming and desertification, he says, air pollution. This problem began in my city when the number of cars increased we should reduce the number of cars in cities. Thank you, Mohammed. So he suggested uh, we should use uh, less cars. We should use uh, public means of transport. Okay, thanks a lot. Now uh, let's have uh, a warming up exercise concerning our lesson. Here, uh, endangered species. We are going to discuss the problem. What are the causes of endangered species? Uh, habitat destruction, uh, legal hunting, climate change. The uh, effects, what effects of endangered species, uh, disturbing uh, the eco ecological balance, uh, negative effects on the food chain. Solutions. 
building nature reserves for them, uh, setting strict rules to ban hunting or to stop people from hunting. Translate into English. Muhammad, you got a kathir mil as babble to add the land crowd bar lehanat. Who can translate this sentence from English, Arabic into English? Notes here the difference between the Arabic language and the English language. This is uh, a uh, uh, sentence uh, which starts with a verb, but we don't start with a verb in English. We start with, with a noun. How will Gumla Falia Gumla Smiya? Muhammad Majdi, yes. Muhammad, uh, there are are many causes leads to lead to animal species of different of of different kind of animals. Yes, uh, lead to what? Animal species or the extinction? Extinction. Yes, thank you. So we can say uh, there are many reasons. There are many uh, causes which cause or which lead to the extinction of some kind of animals or the extinction of uh, some animal species. Good. فهد هذا صحيح من أهم هذه الأسباب تدمير موت طبيعي اللي تعيش فيه وكذلك الصيد الغير قانوني والتلوث البيئي. Translate into English. زياد حاتم. Okay. Never mind. Uh, that's right. Uh, one of the reasons, uh, uh, the, the most important reason, uh, the, the destruction of the natural habitat in which uh, yes. they live. Good. Uh, also, uh, uh, as well as illegal fishing and uh, sorry, illegal uh, hunting, hunting and uh, pollution and the pollution. And the pollution or uh, environmental environmental pollution. Thank you. So here, that's right. The most important reasons are because the, uh, you mentioned three. The most important reasons are the destruction of the natural habitat of these animals or where they live, the illegal hunting, or you can say poaching and environmental pollution. Now, the next exercise here uh, on, on your workbook. What are you going to do? You, this is what? This is an open letter. But uh, it's not in the correct order. You are going to put the five paragraphs. So this is uh, an open letter. It's made of uh, five paragraphs. You are going to rank or sorry, rearrange these uh, paragraphs uh, into the correct order. Write the numbers one to five in the space above each uh, paragraph. Please read the whole letter and write the numbers. Uh, rearrange these five paragraphs to the correct order to make it uh, sense, to make it uh, understandable. So this letter is written by members of the Aranaton Protection Society to the uh, to the editor of Today magazine. I'll give you three minutes or four minutes to read uh, the letter and rearrange by writing numbers from one to five.
Yes, Faris. Uh, number one, uh, this letter is to everyone who is worried about animals in, uh, in the world, in the world which uh, are in danger of uh, extinction. Danger uh, of extinction. This number, this is number one. One. Uh, number two, the simplest uh, thing to do uh, to do what uh, would be to collect mo uh, money to send uh, to one of the of the centers uh, which uh, protect this amazing animals and help uh, to keep them in the in the wild. Number two. Thank you. OK, la la let's check la la later. Thank you, Faris. OK, let's listen to Yusuf Sayed. <laughs> Uh, uh, but the most important uh, way they could help would be to tell everyone uh, they know about the situation of the uh, organisms, Oranatums. Oranatums. Oranatums, and how their forest habitats are being destroyed. Thank you. Okay. Um, Let's. Uh, thank you, Yusuf. Let's uh, listen to uh, Ziad. Uh, paragraph one, uh, we would like to ask uh, your readers to think about how they can help to save. Do you think this is number one? We would like to ask. So you didn't mention, uh, you didn't mention the reason for or, uh, or who's uh, who's the letter two. We would like to ask your readers to think about how they can help to save the orangutans. Right, uh, this is. This letter is, is to everyone who is worried about animals in the world. OK, OK, thank you, Ziad. Uh, Mohamed Majdi. Uh, number one, uh, uh, this letter is uh, to, very, to everyone who is worried yes. about animals in the world uh, which are in danger of extinction. Number two, we should like to ask uh, your reader. Uh, number three, uh, the symbol, uh, symbol, the things uh, to do would be to collect money. Uh, number four, uh, we are very grateful uh, uh, to you uh, for uh, bringing uh, this problem to the uh, attention. And, and, last uh, and the last one, uh, but uh, the most important way uh, they could help uh, would would uh, would be to uh, tell everyone. Uh, they they know about uh, the uh, situation of the orangutans 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 and how their uh, forest uh, habitat habitats are being <laughs> destroyed. Thanks, Salat Muhammad. Okay, let's check the answer here. So let's see. The first one. Uh, we would like to ask your reader to think about how they can help to save the orangutans. Do you, uh, do you agree with this one or this letter is to everyone? This letter is to everyone who is worried about animals in the world which are in danger. We would like to ask uh, your readers to think about how they can help to save the orangutans of Perennial Sumatra. I think the, uh, the opposite is right. Uh, this letter should be number one. This letter it should be number one. And we would like this number two. OK. Number three is the simplest thing to do would be to collect money. The fourth one we will be or are very grateful to you. And the last one, but the most important way uh, they could help would be to tell everyone they know about the situation. So I think this is uh, here four, five, three, one, two, four, five, three, one, two. OK, thank you. Now uh, let's move to the next exercise here. What are we going to do? We are going to uh, uh, read these uh, headings and uh, write the paragraphs, read the paragraphs in the correct uh, order and answer the question. Which paragraph describes the decline of the Aranatons? Describes the decline of the Aranatons. The number of uh, orangutans has decreased. Maad Muhammad. Paragraph number uh, two. We would like okay, to ask. We would like to ask here. Let's move to uh, here. 
uh, we would like to ask your reader to think about how they can help to save the orientals. At the moment, there are 20,000. So I agree. So this number, this is number two, not one. OK, this is number two. Uh, we, I think Maz, says who, or which paragraph says who the letter is intended for? Yes, Karim. Uh, paragraph number two, this letter is to everyone. Yes, this paragraph number two. أنا أبغى نعكسها نخليها يا كريم نخليها هنا two one as you mentioned here this letter is to everyone this it should be number one so the right answer here two one not one two which paragraph suggests something that would be simple for people to do to help suggests something that would be simple suggests solution what can people do simply to help Uh, Mohammed Majdi. Uh, number three. Number three. Can you read it? Don't have the book in front of you. No, I, I read on the screen. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. Number three. The simplest thing to do would be to collect money to send it to one of the centers, which protect these amazing animals and help to keep them in the wild. Good, this is number three, I agree. So we have the answers, two, one, three. Two, one, three. Okay, which paragraph thanks the editor of Today magazine? Which paragraph thanks the editor of Today magazine? Mohamed? Uh, number five, we are uh, very grateful to you for beginning uh, this problem. Yes, so let's see. Yes, we are very grateful, yes, to you for bringing this problem to the attention of your readers. This is number four, yes. And the last one, which paragraph suggests the best thing people could do to help? The best thing, Yusuf Sayed? Uh, number five. Number five here, let's see. Uh, but the most important way they could help would be to tell everyone they know about the situation of the orangs and how their first habitats are being destroyed. So it's very important to raise people's awareness about uh, this kind of problem. So this number, as uh, uh, answer right, answer again, two, one, three, four, five. Okay. What are you going to do next? Write your own open letter asking people for donations to help a local organization to protect wildlife in Kuwait. هنكتب رسالة موجهة للمجلة أو جريدة زي ما قلنا open letter so that uh, many, many people can read it. You are asking people for donations. أنت مطلوب منك تكتب رسالة بتطلب تبرعات بتطلب من الناس يتبرعوا to help uh, a local organization to protect wildlife in Kuwait. أن يجمعوا فلوس أو يتبرعوا بمبلغ يساعدوا منظمة محلية داخل الكويت يعني لحماية حال بري في الكويت. Justify the need, the importance of it. Uh, of it. Uh, uh, برهن أو بر حاجة حاجة المساعدة دي أو التبرعات وأهميتها. Why should we, why should people donate uh, uh, some of their money uh, to help endangered species? So you show uh, the importance of that. And use the letter from the Oriental Protection Society as a model. Start them in the letter from Can a music team switch to it? Replacing the underlined parts of the letter with your own ideas. Step the بعض الكلمات اللي حطيتها خط زي ما تشوفينه. هتلاقي في رسالة في بعض الأجزاء تحتها خطوط. Make sure you expand on the original letter. حاول تجعله ممتدة زي الرسالة الأصلية. زي ما تشوف هنا في بعض الجمل بعض العبارات موجودة تحتها خط أو. We are very grateful to you for bringing this problem to the attention of your readers. Uh, tell everyone they know about the situation of the orangutans and how their forest habitats are being destroyed. Uh, collect money to send uh, to one of the centers which protect these amazing animals and help them to keep, uh, keep them in the wild. Animals in the world which are in danger of extinction. So you are going to replace these underlined uh, parts or phrases. There are about or there are 20,000 
or save the orangutans of Borneo and Sumatra, you are talking about uh, a local problem in Kuwait. So you ask people for donations to uh, help uh, uh, an organization or environmental organization to protect the wildlife in Kuwait. You can write some of your ideas and send them on the channel. I'll give you uh, two or three minutes to give me some notes here. You can write on your channel. Give me uh, some notes. You are not going to write the whole letter now. OK, please write some of your notes here. On the screen. Waiting for your answers. You have written Mohammed? Uh, donation, Mana Tabarra? Donation, yes. Donate, Ya Tabarra, donation Tabarra. Yes. Donate, donation. Has anybody written any notes?
Muhammad starts. I send this letter to people. Uh, people who should donate to help wildlife. So you should put uh, who or the pronoun. Good, Muhammad. Now I'll give you a sample here or a model a model a paragraph. Let's have a look at this screen. The editor of Al Watan magazine. We would like to invite your readers to donate for our organization to help in protecting the Gulf Coast in Salwa region. Ahmed Sahel Khalij fi Salwa. At the moment, there is a lot of pollution that can threaten the Gulf and the health of the people living there. So you talk about the reason why should they donate money? Uh, because it's very important to uh, keep people's health. It has a negative effect on the life of fish and sea animals. So this is the first paragraph. We would like to invite your readers to donate for the, uh, our organization to help in protecting the Gulf Coast in Salwa region at the moment. As there is a lot of pollution that can threaten the Gulf and the health of the people living there. It has a negative effect on the life of the fish and sea animals. Notes here, there are some uh, mistakes here. Uh, Salwa should be capital letter because it's uh, an area or a city. Uh, the Gulf or the Gulf Coast should be uh, G capital and C capital because it's the name of the street. And here the Gulf uh, should be capital also. And at the moment, he should start with the A capital. Uh, this is the beginning of the sentence. Now let's move to another one. Here, uh, dear donors, uh, or dear donors, well, as we know, you are good people and you always ready to help a creature with problems. We are writing to tell you about a human problem. Many animals are in danger as well as plants. We should all do our best to save the wildlife it's our duty to do so. It's very important to save the wildlife. If we don't save wildlife, many animals will die and others will die out. Die out and cut or die to moot. Also, many trees will die and one day we may get in many problems as a result of that. So this is what uh, the, uh, asking people for donation and giving reasons showing the importance of helping and protecting the environment. Let's see a third one or a similar one. Here, uh, I'm uh, I'm for spending some money on saving endangered species, but uh, not too much. Here, some people are for, some people are against spending money on saving endangered species. This is uh, another topic, but not too much. Preserving endangered species is not an entirely costly business, but maybe a profitable action of mankind. Someone may argue that it is not the moral duty of man to protect them. I believe that uh, saving them will put an end to man's problems on planet Earth in the long run. People who suffer from famines, diseases and natural disasters will find their refuge in nature around them. Almost 20 out of 80,000 species of edible plants produce 90% of the world's food. The shark, for instance, is one of the endangered species. Nevertheless, according to recent scientific researches, the brain of a shark may help man cure some mental diseases, and the venom of snakes has also been researched in medical fields. If we have not yet found a use of, uh, for some species, this does not mean that they are useless. Insects, for example, were discovered uh, to benefit agriculture. Protecting and conserving endangered species has not become a luxury. It has a great value for human activities such as education, recreation, and the most important thing is that it balances the biological chain or the ecological chain, which is important for our ecosystem. Here, uh, there are some reasons for spending more money uh, to protect endangered species. So you can get more ideas uh, when you read these uh, these topics. 
Farmers are using insects and other animals. They prey on crop pests. They are a safe, effective, and less expensive alternative to, to synthetic chemicals. Many medical substances are extracted from some species and used in uh, drugs to treat heart diseases, cancer, and many other illnesses. Many individual species are indicators for environmental quality and alter or alert us to the effects of pollutants before more damage is done. Observing different species gives man useful information that can be used in different fields such as aviation, shipmaking, etc. Many species benefit the ecosystem as they filter the air and water, regulate climates, increase soil fertility, and maintain the biological diversity. Some species are providers for products and services uh, essential uh, to human welfare. The disappearance of one species will affect countless others. So far, scientists have found out only a small number of the world species and have. That's all. Uh, thank you so much. So you should be uh, the solution. Reduce pollution. Go green. Thank you. Until we meet again next week. Goodbye and good luck. Thank you, teacher. You are welcome, Hamid.